Hey, Dr. Shaki here from Irvine Spinal Wellness Center, your Irvine chiropractor. Let's talk about laptop use on your lap. How about that? Stay tuned. <laughs> you're using your laptop you already know you're really jacking up your neck not a good idea you keep hearing me tell you do not use your laptop it needs to be eye level so now let's talk about using your laptop when you're laying down on your bed which I know you're doing so let's see how you can make the best of it the best thing honestly is to not use your laptop my least favorite is an iPad. I do have an iPad, but it really messes up your neck. But what you want to do is actually this. So let's pretend this is my bed and I have like my pillow all lined up here and all that jazz. So I'm going to go ahead and forget about my neck. Just pretend it's in a good shape. So I'm going to bring, put my laptop here and actually open it up. So the best thing to do is to try to bring, of course, I've got my glasses on here, so that's not gonna work. You wanna adjust your neck so you're not really stretching your head to try to look at your screen. So your neck is really this way. You're better off modifying your legs to change that. So this is a little too low. What I'm gonna do is just do this and read. If you need to increase the font size, you're going to do that. So what I don't want you to do is bringing your elbows up and doing it this way. That's a lot of work by the muscles around your shoulder blade scapular area. So you want to be, once again, open this up as much as you can, bring it up to the eye level. And once again, why in the heck are you sleeping and using your laptop? That's a better question to ask. <laughs> So that's about it. Make sure you minimize the amount of your digital devices as much as possible. But if you have to be on that laptop, try to bring the ergonomics, proper positioning of the actual device to your head position and your eye position because every little thing actually adds up. That's about it. Take care.